We're here with the head coach of the Kahoma Tiger baseball team starting a brand new season this year. Coach Lee Hodge. Coach, how you doing? Good, VK. How you? Pretty good. Pretty good. Almost time for the season opener, and we're looking forward to some good things. Last season, you guys won over 20 games, and you're looking to do a lot more. I hope so. We're looking to we're looking to expand on our 21 wins last year, and um, it's a good group. Love them. They they work hard. Pitching's pitching's where it's at. We got to throw strikes. We throw strikes. We got a chance um, to win some ball games. Well, last year you got a lot of really good. Uh, non-conference wins and a couple of conference wins but I know last season it was pretty tough because we know the Mac GC is probably the toughest baseball conference in the country. It is. I think at one time there was 11 uh, teams ranked nationally um, We and we did have some big conference wins last year and we're looking to expand on it. Well looking at the returning players that you have it seems like you have a good bit of experience coming back this year. Can you tell us about your experience coming back, especially on the pitching side. We've got two returning sophomores that threw a, a ton of innings last year. Um, Eduardo, um, Eddie came in through a bunch for us last year, and he's going to continue to do that. Um, White Bailey uh, threw a lot of innings for us. Um, I'm I'm really excited uh, excited about the pitching staff because they did throw strikes. Uh, Colt Burns has come in and done a tremendous job with him. They respect him. He's won in this league before. He won up at Arkansas Tech. He, he knows what it takes, and these guys are listening to him and expanding on what um, what they've done last year. And, and that's where we're at right now. We're ready to face some other guys, too. We're facing our guys, inner squads. They're ready to face somebody other than a Maroon team. Well, taking a look, talk about a little bit of your freshman and your – transfers coming in. I heard those some you got some big help coming. We do. We got a, a transfer in from Georgia Southern, uh, Kyler Johnson. He should be a big stick from the right side playing third base for us. Hector Torres. He tore it up last year. Had a great had a great year. Um, left fielder. Gilder had a great year. Um, so here, here's the deal. One through four, one through five can get after it. We're fast. I like to hit and run. We like to steal bases, and all those guys can do that. And Johnson just gives us the power to leave, you know, leave the yard when we need to. Well, you guys will start the season off early, and you'll open at home. And tell us about the opponent in that same time, what we expect from your crew coming into finally the first game of the year. Well, you got a team coming in from Arkansas, NAIA school, uh, that's well coached. We played them in the fall. They're they're going to get after it. And they're going to do the right things on the mound as well. Defensively, they throw strikes. Um, it's a battle every week with these guys. Whether you're in the MAC JC or your non-conference schedules, they get after it. And they're, it's good baseball here in the South. And I'm excited. I'm ready to go. And and the school is it's it's Christian Baptist, I believe. It's, it's a, um, Central. It's Central, Central Baptist. Baptist. Yeah, it's Central Baptist, and we become, you know, they always they're recruiting our guys and they. It's a it's a good opportunity for us to to go up there and give them a, a you know an opportunity to throw against those guys. So you know these four year schools, they're they're coming in here wanting our guys, and you know it gives them a good look uh, competing against each other. Well, how unique is with you guys? Like my first time here in Mississippi, like you know how unique is playing at home at Eddie Smith Sports Plex? I know it's a little bit kind of you know unique that you guys play mostly in the daytime for your home games well and that helps you know the, i get that question a lot are you or uh, why don't you play under the lights why don't you why don't you reach out and try to get lights well first off it's expensive to get lights second off it's cold i don't mind playing at noon you know we we use that as a home field advantage it's a it's a big yard there's not a whole lot of balls that leave the yard um so we get to play our game here. It's, uh, you know, like I said, we're going to get on and we're going to run. We're going to hit and run, hit behind runners. And uh, I think we do have some guys that can leave the yard. But uh, the the wind here and the, the size of our field keep a lot of balls in our yard. And I, I think it just plays to our advantage. Coach Lee Hodge of the Coma Baseball Tigers, we thank you for joining us. And we wish you luck 
in the season opener and in the 2018 season. Thanks, BK.